In process of time, we see how the family became weaker. And so, it was Cain and Abel who came before the Lord with their offering. The Lord accepted Abel's offering. But Cain was not accepted. Why? The Lord said unto him, Just maybe sin is at the door. Maybe there is sin. Sin lies at the door, as we see in Genesis 4 and verse 7. He was not pleased with God. He was not happy with his brother. The fact that his brother's offering was accepted before the Lord. Instead of Cain walking away and repent and make amendments with God, fix his problem, he took it out on his brother. He became very angry with his brother. His brother did not do anything, anything wrong. It was Cain that was at fault. And so what happened in verse 8 of chapter 4, Genesis? And Cain talked with Abel his brother, and it came to pass when they were in the field, that Cain rose up against Abel his brother and slew him. See what sin does? The Bible tells us that the wages of sin is death. The Lord told Adam that if he eats of the tree of knowledge, good and evil, the result will be death. You will die. They disobeyed. And we see that carry over in Cain, who rose up and killed his innocent brother. His brother who did nothing wrong. All because of sin. As termites would destroy your house, your property, Sometimes so weak that it's things that dilapidate and things start falling apart and eventually that whole house will have to be taken down to protect others. And we see what's happening here. Adam sin came to his brother because of sin. Sin starts multiplying as the termites will come into your house and multiply. Sin started multiplying. So what happened? Well, for a while, men were calling upon the name of the Lord. Men had given up on calling on God. In process of time, in verse 25 of chapter 4, Adam knew his wife. Again, and bear a son and call his name Seth. For God, she said, hath appointed me another seed instead of Abel, whom Cain slew. And to Seth, to him also there was born a son. And he called his name Enos. Then began men to call upon the name of the Lord. And then we go into Seth's family and we can see from Enos all the way to Lamech the descendants of Seth. But it was from Seth again men start calling upon the name of the Lord. And we have all these men here, Methuselah and all the time he lived over 900 years, 962 to be exact, and Lamech. And from Lamech came Noah. 
And by the time Noah, how old was Noah? Noah in verse, let's look at verse 30 of the same chapter. And Lamech lived after he begot Noah 595 years and begot sons and daughters. And all the days of Lamech was 770 and 7 years and he died. And Noah was 500 years old and Noah begot Shem, Ham, and Japheth. So Lamech had sons and daughters. One of his sons' name was Noah. Noah had sisters. I want you to keep that in mind. Just to see what sin does. Starting from Adam. And here we get to Noah. And in chapter 6, it came to pass, verse 1, when men began to multiply on the, on the face of the earth, and daughters were born unto them, that the sons of God saw the daughters of men that they were feared, and they took them wives of all which they choose. And the Lord said, my spirit shall not always strive with men, man, for that he also is flesh, yet his day shall be an hundred and twenty years. So, we see Seth, men start calling upon the name of the Lord. We see Noah, uh, one of Lamech's uh, sons. God looked down upon the earth and he see that the line of Seth was intermingling with the Canaanites, having children, intermarriage. And God saw in verse 5, the wickedness of man was great in the earth, and that every imagination of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continually. So how did God feel about that? And just imagine from creation maybe 1500 years later every thought and imagination of man was evil continually. The Lord was not very pleased with his creation. Our God was not happy with what he was seeing. And it repented the Lord that he had made man on the earth. And it grieved him to his heart. God was really hurt to see what man has had become. His whole thought, his imagination, was evil. And the Lord said, I will destroy man who I have created from the face of the earth, both man and beast and creeping thing and fowl of the air. For it repented me that I have made them. How about Seth and his family? Where are they? It, is, it was after Seth was born Man began to call upon the name of the Lord. Prior to Seth, Adam and Eve, they did not have a very happy family. The Lord looked down. He was not pleased with what he was seeing. He was grieved. 